Hi guys, Adam here. Just following up from my previous videos and articles on setting targets and goals for your health and fitness. I've had a few questions from subscribers who are a little bit stuck on where to go with setting their goals, not entirely sure of the, the process. Now I did set it out in a step-by-step -step approach, but, but trying to find that inspiration sometimes can be a bit of a challenge, especially when you're new to the space, you don't know what is, what is possible. So my advice for you, if you're struggling to come up with a target or trying to find something that inspires you, is, is go small and short with your fitness and health goals. What this does, it puts it, puts it within arm's, arm's reach. So try and find something that's gonna be take you four to six weeks to achieve. And what that does gives you a little bit of confidence that, that you can, ach can achieve that, that goal and that target. If you set a, a big goal long-term, which, which I'm a big fan of, but if you haven't uh, been in the space for it before and you're not entirely sure and you, you have a few setbacks, it can deter you and you wanna throw in the towel and say, oh, this is, this is too hard. I'm, I'm not sure that my body can actually achieve that. But by going small and short, it, it, gains, it gives you that uh, momentum. It gives you that early win. So you build your confidence but the second thing that does that's, that's one of the most important things is it uncovers potential inspiration and future goals. So if you don't know where you wanna take your fitness in the long, long term, by, by setting that initial goal and exposing yourself to trainers, coaches, books, or, or just an environment of, of being in a gym if you haven't been in a gym before, and you start to see, oh, that guy's lifting you know, 100 kilos on his, on his bench press, like that, that's impressive, I, I wanna do that. So being in that environment, you, you can start to see other people operating on a higher level that, than perhaps where you are, and you can start to think, okay, I wanna be like that person, and, and that's great, because the next thing is, is then you can start to model the people that, that are, are successful in that space, and that can shortcut some of the setbacks if you were going to lose 10 kilos and you weren't entirely sure and you're gonna battle away by yourself, if you've seen someone else do it before, they've, they've experienced all the setbacks and things that could have been hard and, and just by going up to that person and speaking to them and saying, how, how did you do it? You can find a resource, whether it's a coach or whether it's just them and they can say, this, this is how I actually achieved this, this fitness target or, or goal and it gives you, gives you that inspiration to go forward and, and to try something new and, and to expose yourself to something that you might not have initially thought was possible or was even out there to achieve. I hope that gives you a little bit more clarification. Feel free to give me comments below or subscribe to the channel. And if you haven't already, go, go over to my website and subscribe uh, to, my, to my free content. I'm always putting up new videos and articles and, and giving you some insight and it's a great opportunity to, for you to give me feedback as well. So I look forward to speaking to you all soon and I hope that helps. Thanks for your time.